Oh my God. On Tuesday, July 25, 2023, around 11 a.m., in Dallas, Texas, the Dallas Police Northwest Covert and Crime Response Team officers were keeping an eye on a stolen U-Haul truck parked in the 9,600 block of El Centro Drive. The officers Shit. observed 41-year-old Ryan Taylor approaching the truck, getting in, and driving away. As Taylor began to drive, he intentionally reversed the truck into an undercover police vehicle. The impact caused the airbags in the police car to deploy and pushed the car into a nearby fire hydrant. It, despite this, Taylor did not stop. Instead, he sped away through the side streets and onto the Dallas North Tollway. For the next 13 minutes, Taylor led the officers on a high-speed chase, refusing to stop and intentionally colliding with 13 other vehicles along the way. After exiting the tollway, Taylor continued to evade the police, hitting additional vehicles until he eventually lost control. His truck hit the center median and a tree before finally crashing in the 7,200 block of Lemon Avenue. Taylor then abandoned the damaged truck and ran towards a private hangar building with an open bay door. The officers chased after Taylor, and during the pursuit, Taylor fired two shots at them. In response, Officer Kenan Craven returned fire, hitting Taylor in the leg. Taylor was then taken into custody and transported to a local hospital for treatment. Remarkably, no officers were injured during the incident, and none of the individuals in the vehicles that Taylor collided with were reported injured either. At the scene, officers recovered the handgun that Taylor had used, which was also reported stolen. Taylor is now facing multiple charges, including aggravated assault with a deadly weapon, aggravated assault of a public servant, unauthorized use of a motor vehicle, and evading arrest in a vehicle. Keep coming! Keep coming! Get out of here and accompany the perimeter. And all, all of the doors of this hangar. 